न्यूयॉर्क सिटी ऑन थर्सडे फाइल्ड अ लॉ सूट अक्यूजिंग सेवनटीन बस कंपनीज ऑफ वायोलेटिंग स्टेट लॉ बाय ट्रांसपोर्टिंग मोर देन थर्टी थ्री थाउजेंड माइग्रेंट्स टू द सिटी फ्रॉम टेक्सस एज पार्ट ऑफ अ कंपेन बाय द स्टेट्स रिपब्लिकन गवर्नर टू एक्सपेल पीपल हु क्रॉस द यू एस मैक्सिको बॉर्डर इलीगली The city is seeking 708 million dollars which it says is the cost is has occurred to provide shelter and services to the migrants over the last 2 years in the lawsuit filed in New York state court in Manhattan New York City has and will continue to do our part to manage this humanitarian crisis but we cannot bear the cost of reckless political ploys from the state of Texas alone. Today, our administration filed a lawsuit against 17 companies that have taken part in Texas Governor Greg Abbott's scheme to transport tens of thousands of migrants to New York City in an attempt to overwhelm our social services system. These companies have violated state law by not paying the cost of caring for these migrants, and that's why We are soon to recoup approximately 700 million dollars already spent to care for migrants bused here in the last two years by the state of Texas. Governor Abbott's continuing use of migrants as political pawns is not only chaotic and inhumane, but makes clear he puts politics over people. Today's lawsuit should serve as a warning to all those who break the law in this way. The lawsuit accuses charter bus operators that contracted with Texas of violating a 19th century New York law that requires anyone who transports a needy person likely to seek government assistance from another state to cover their expenses.